I'm Grace. So let's get started. I'm a recipe blogger, family taught home chef. Cheers. Cheers. iPhone only photographer and proud New Englander. The juiciest chicken with homemade lemon pepper seasoning and a quick but flavorful pan sauce is the perfect weekday or weekend meal. Most lemon pepper chicken recipes out there use your shaker lemon pepper seasoning, which is good in a pinch, but if you want real good lemon pepper chicken, say that 10 times fast, you want to make your own, and it's actually so easy to make the seasoning. You just need lemons, a little olive oil, and pepper. So you're gonna take some fresh lemons, make sure you wash your lemons before you do this, and you're just going to zest them. Don't get the white in there. The white underneath the yellow is bitter. There was really nothing better than the smell of fresh lemon zest. Oh. Next step, lots of black pepper. Get your mussels ready. You want about a teaspoon of freshly cracked black pepper. Freshly cracked, freshly cracked <laughs> is key. Excuse me. This is how I work out, via pepper. In we go. A little salt. And a splash of olive oil. And this is just gonna bind your lemon pepper seasoning together and make it easily spreadable. So a tablespoon there. Take a spoon and just mix it together. Well, you can do chicken breasts. Chicken thighs are so superior, come on. And I like to bake the chicken thighs because it's no mess, you just throw them in the oven, you can grill them if you want, you can throw them on the stove and do it, sear it if you want. But I just like to take my lemon pepper seasoning and a basting brush and give each thigh a nice little brush of that lemon pepper seasoning. One of my top posts on my blog is how to bake a deliciously juicy chicken thigh, and there's a reason why it's my top post. 425 for about 18 to 23 minutes until it registers at least 165. Of course, you could stop there and just have lemon pepper chicken as is, but why stop there when you can make a little pan sauce and make it so much better? So, quick and easy, we're talking. A little bit of olive oil. Oh, signs down. <laughs> and some garlic and shallot. The best combination ever. And we're gonna sweat this over medium high heat for just a couple minutes until the shallot is nice and fragrant. The base of our sauce is I have a little bit of chicken broth and I'm also gonna add in some dry white wine and you don't need to use the wine if you don't want to but doesn't wine make everything a little better? The two together make the perfect sauce. So add that right in. I have some fresh lemon, lemon squeeze, lemon juice. Yum, we wanna play off the lemon flavor of the lemon pepper. And I'm missing something, yes. A little bit of Dijon mustard is gonna add a creaminess, almost a little saltiness. And speaking of salt, a pinch of salt. And we're gonna let this cook only for about two to three minutes. Let it simmer down, all the flavors will meld together, and then we'll add two secret ingredients as a final touch. Look at that steam, woo! It's time. Take your pot off the stove, just so it's not on that hot burner. And the two secret ingredients to the best pan sauce ever, a little knob of butter. You wanna just let that melt off the heat. And then I just have some fresh parsley here and I'm just gonna be kind of rustic. Take a little handful, even with the stems, it's okay and just throw that little handful right into the sauce. Give it a stir and you'll have a perfect, delicious sauce.
the juiciest of juicy chicken thighs with an amazing lemon pepper seasoning. Mm. The essence of lemon, that homemade lemon pepper seasoning, a mm -hmm. little bit of that amazing pan sauce mm -hmm. on the outside with the crunch of the shallot, freshness of the parsley. Mm -hmm. mm. Check this out on tastefullygrace.com. You won't regret it. This is gonna fit extra lemon pepper chicken.